Listening section. In this section of the test, you will have the chance to show how well you understand spoken English. There are four parts to this section, with special directions for each part. Part one: pictures. Questions one to three. Directions. For each item, there is a picture in your test book. And four short statements about it on the tape. They are spoken twice, and are not written out in your test book. So you must listen carefully. You must choose one statement: A, B, C, or D that best describes the picture. Then, on your answer sheet, mark your choice. Example. Look at the following picture. Now listen to the following statement. A. There is a glass in front of them. B. There is a wardrobe behind them. C. The garden is near the door. D. They are sitting on a sofa. Choice D. They are sitting on the sofa. Best describes. What is seen in the picture? Therefore, you should mark D on your answer sheet. Let's begin with question number one. Number one. A. The people are swimming in the sea. B. The family is running on the sand. C. The strangers are going into the water. D. They are racing at the pool. Number one. A. The people are swimming in the sea. B. The family is running on the sand. C. The strangers are going into the water. D. They are racing at the pool. Number two. A. She is standing in front of the shelf. B. She is writing by the rack. C. She is sitting on a bench. D. She is standing next to the table. Number two. A. She is standing in front of the shelf. B. She is writing by the rack. C. She is sitting on a bench. D. She is standing next to the table. Number three. A. The woman has short curly hair. B. The man looks very angry. C. The couple are wearing bracelets. D. The man has thick eyebrows. Number three. A. The woman has short curly hair. B. The man looks very angry. C. The couple are wearing bracelets. D. The man has thick eyebrows. Part two. Question. Responses. Questions four to seven. Directions. In this part of the test, you will hear several questions spoken in English, followed by three responses. Also spoken in English. The questions and responses will be spoken twice. 
they will not be printed in your test book. So you must listen carefully to understand what the speakers say. You have to choose the best response to each question. Now listen to a sample question. You will hear Why don't you come with us to the concert? You will also hear A. I like watching concerts B. Yes, you'll join us soon C. Sorry, I can't Maybe next time Choice C. Sorry I can't. Maybe next time. Is the response to the question, Why don't you join us to the concert? Therefore, you should mark C on your answer sheet. Number four. Shouldn't we check in with the receptionist? A. I didn't bring my checkbook. B. Yes. We should check it out. C. Yes, I suppose so. Number four. Shouldn't we check in with the receptionist? A. I didn't bring my checkbook. B. Yes. We should check it out. C. Yes, I suppose so. Number five. Would you participate in our family gathering? A. Sure, I'd love to. B. Yes, I have a lot to do. C. My family is not gathering. Number five. Would you participate in our family gathering? A. Sure, I'd love to. B. Yes, I have a lot to do. C. My family is not gathering. Number six. How do I get to the boardroom? A. She is getting bored. B. Just walk around the corner. C. We don't have enough rooms. Number six. How do I get to the boardroom? A. She is getting bored. B. Just walk around the corner. C. We don't have enough rooms. Number seven. Do you need some help with that package? A. Yes, they have picked it up. B. Sure, thanks. C. Sorry, but I just can't help you. Number seven. Do you need some help with that package? A. Yes, they have picked it up. B. Sure, thanks. C. Sorry, but I just can't help you. Part 3. Short Conversations Questions 8 to 11 Directions In this section of the test, you will hear several short conversations. 
you will hear the conversations twice. The conversations will not be printed in your test book, so you must listen carefully to understand what the speakers say. In your test book, you will read a question about each conversation. The question will be followed by four answers. You have to choose the best answer to each question and mark it on your answer sheet. Example. You will hear. Do you still have two tickets for the 12:30 p.m. tour? Yes, we do. But they are for the black seat, and the tour will run in 30 minutes, sir. That's fine. I'll be on my way now. Just keep them for me. You will read. What is the conversation about? A. Ticket cancellation. B. Booking tickets for a concert. C. Four schedules. D. Reserving tickets for a tour. Choice D, reserving tickets for a tour, is the best answer to the question, "What is the conversation about?" Therefore, you should mark D on your answer sheet. Number eight. What does your sister do in the office? She usually handles phone calls and arranges meetings. Number eight. What does your sister do in the office? She usually handles phone calls and arranges meetings. Number nine. Can I reserve two business class tickets from Surabaya to Makassar for Sunday the twentieth? Okay. One moment, please. I can book you on Jaya Airways, leaving at 9 a.m. on the 20th with an hour layover in Jakarta. Great, I'll take it. Number nine. Can I reserve two business class tickets from Surabaya to Makassar? For Sunday the twentieth. Okay, one moment, please. I can book you on Jaya Airways, leaving at 9 a.m. on the twentieth with an hour layover in Jakarta. Great, I'll take it. Number ten. Do you mind if I use your computer? No, please shut it down after you finish. I will. Thank you. Number ten. Do you mind if I use your computer? No, please shut it down after you finish. I will. Thank you. Number eleven. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Number eleven. Hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Part four. Short talks. Questions twelve to fifteen. Directions. In this part of the test, you will hear several 
short talks. Each will be spoken twice. They will not be printed in your test book, so you must listen carefully to understand and remember what is said. In your test book, you will read two or more questions about each short talk. Each question will be followed by four answers. You have to choose the best answer to each question and mark it on your answer sheet. Questions 12 and 13 refer to the following procedure. Good evening everyone. Welcome to the Tung Jung Real Estate Training Course. My name is Arif Hidayat and I'm a licensed real estate and personal director for Tung Jung. At the end of our five-week course, all of you, hopefully, will be able to pass the real estate exam and become Tung Jung agents. Here are some things to note before we begin our training. First, you need to hand in your green class registration forms at the table in the front of the room. Then, go to the table against the right wall to find your name tag and a packet of course information. Next, go to the table at the back corner to pick up your textbook. Once you have done all these things, find a seat and sit down. When everyone's ready, Putra Perkasa, our company president, will say a few words. After that, we'll head down to the conference room for tonight's first class. Now read question number 12 and answer it. Now read question number 13 and answer it. Questions 12 and 13 refer to the following procedure. Good evening everyone. Welcome to the Tung Jung Real Estate Training Course. My name is Arif Hidayat and I'm a licensed real estate and personal director for Tung Jung. At the end of our five-week course, all of you, hopefully, will be able to pass the real estate exam and become Tung Jung agents. Here are some things to note before we begin our training. First, you need to hand in your green class registration forms at the table in the front of the room. Then, go to the table against the right wall to find your name tag and a packet of course information. Next, go to the table at the back corner to pick up your textbook. Once you have done all these things, find a seat and sit down. When everyone's ready, Putra Perkasa, our company president, will say a few words. After that, we'll head down to the conference room for tonight's first class. Now read question number 12 and answer it. Now read question number 13 and answer it. Questions 14 and 15 refer to the following announcement. We are pleased to announce that the company will be opening its very own cafeteria for employers next month. Now, if you forget to bring your lunch to work, you won't have to leave the building to get a delicious and nutritious lunch. The cafeteria will feature sandwiches, soups 
and other delicious entrees at reasonable prices. Salads, snacks, coffee, tea and soda will also be available. Each week on Monday morning, the chef will post the menu on the bulletin board near the entrance. Our growth in the industry this year has allowed us to make this much needed improvement to our work environment. Now read question number 14 and answer it. Now read question number 15 and answer it. Questions 14 and 15 refer to the following announcement. We are pleased to announce that the company will be opening its very own cafeteria for employers next month. Now, if you forget to bring your lunch to work, you won't have to leave the building to get a delicious and nutritious lunch. The cafeteria will feature sandwiches, soups and other delicious entrees at reasonable prices. Salads, snacks, coffee, tea and soda will also be available. Each week on Monday morning, the chef will post the menu on the bulletin board near the entrance. Our growth in the industry this year has allowed us to make this much needed improvement to our work environment. Now read question number 14 and answer it. Now read question number 15 and answer it. This is the end of the listening section.